Hello, dear friends. Today uh, we are in the office building of the Skyway project in Dubai, and I'm talking to one of the top managers of Skyway here, but let him uh, introduce himself. Hello, uh, Mr. Raman. Yeah, my name is Raman Marwa. I am a senior vice president of Skyway Green Tech of, uh, in Sharjah, and uh, I am holding a position of uh, arranging all the senior management positions for the for the group of skyway and my as such my background is uh, i am an engineer and an mba master of business administration from india i have a long experience of three decades in infrastructure development and uh, for this uh, i have always we i have worked in uh, Public sector means uh, in the government as well as in uh, private sector. In uh, tenure of my 30 years of uh, working in various uh, mega infrastructure projects. And uh, I was uh, representing government of India on a various, uh, you can say, uh, bilateral uh, uh, arrangements and bilateral treaties between the countries. And I was uh, the country manager for... Uh, Ministry of uh, Industry uh, in the earlier part of my career and uh, that time also I was in Dubai representing Government of India and after that I have joined the private sector for uh, doing a lot of uh, big project in the infrastructure which uh, ranges from uh, setting up of uh, say power project to road projects as well as uh, some kind of a uh, innovative project related to automated car parking which is uh, more of a first time in the world which we were developing my previous assignment and uh, many other projects which are of, uh, of significance in the oil and gas and other sectors so this is uh, how i have uh, got uh, experience of uh, working in mega projects and that is on a PPP basis, that is a public-private partnership and which is uh, now the most required mode of uh, private financing to establish uh, mega projects on the ground. So uh, I have got uh, this uh, three decades of experience in uh, working in uh, various uh, sectors and with the government as well as private sector. This is uh, as such is my background. And uh, for the time being, uh, I have uh, been a part of, proud to be a part of uh, Skyway Group. And uh, now I have got an opportunity to establish uh, Skyway uh, Innovative and Futuristic uh, Technology uh, uh, Demonstration Center in Sharjah, which is going to be a sustainable uh, transportation mode of uh, carrying uh, passenger as well as uh, cargo which is uh, very futuristic and it is a part of a sustainability effort of uh, all countries as you can say and it is going to be a, a destructive technology which is uh, going to take place in the heart of uh, UAE. UAE being a uh, you can say breeding ground of all innovations and this is appropriate or more uh, relevant and uh, a good place for these kind of innovations. So we are developing this project and uh, first phase of the project is under nearly under completion and uh, which is uh, related to uh, passenger transportation system and uh, this is uh, uh, after completion of this um, simultaneously we are starting phase two of the project which is uh, for the cargo line and the, which we are going to demonstrate the technologies related to cargo uh, transportation. So this is what uh, we have uh, at the moment uh, trying to establish as a demonstration center to work to see this futuristic innovative technology. And uh, as the time grows and the time uh, moves and we are going to, uh, we have very the eager, uh, you can say, uh, we are in our endeavor to establish further uh, our footprint in UAE. Uh, we have been uh, approached by various government and uh, of uh, Emirates, 
and Sharjah government, Fujairah government as well as Abu Dhabi government is very keen to work with us and uh, to make it into on a commercial basis. Uh, and on this, uh, uh, we would be very happy to uh, join uh, with the government to work on a PPP basis or any other commercial mode of uh, arrangement where we can provide this opportunity for uh, for the people to experience it and to minimize. So uh, this is on the anvil, but our uh, first aim is to set up our demonstration center first. Once it is there, people will uh, have a confidence of having uh, to see in or dry on uh, ride on the these uh, our uh, uh, transportation solutions once it is there so we will take it to the next stage so this is what uh, we are working on and uh, as what we feel it is a going to be a major paradigm shift in a transportation sector which is uh, going to be changing the whole uh, uh, transportation sector scenario and maybe a, a niche space for uh, other than metro and uh, railways which is more of a I can say a traditional one but uh, uh, Skyway innovation and Skyway solution is going to be a some paradigm shift in times to come this is what I feel so Thank you very much. Uh, you seem to be uh, understanding uh, the essence of the Skyway technology. That is uh, my first introduction to Skyway technology was in uh, almost two and a half years back in my previous assignment when I have visited uh, there is a traffic exhibition, there is a Gulf traffic exhibition where a Skypod has been uh, displayed there. So that was really that time very exciting and uh, very path-breaking kind of a technology what we have uh, uh, we were ex we have seen that so that was my first uh, you can say experience of having uh, known skyway but i never know that i would be part of this uh, journey and uh, i have joined them almost uh, 9 months now and uh, so I am part of this journey and uh, I would uh, like to make it uh, success so that we would be seeing that it would be running on a commercial basis and uh, people will experience it. Thank you very much and probably the last question that I have for you today. Uh, is it nothing personal, just business for you or uh, do you really believe in our goals in our ideals, in Skyway ideals, I mean. Yeah, as I've told you, because uh, of my long experience of uh, 30 years, and in that uh, we I have uh, taken a lot of challenges. So it is more like a passion for making it a success and part becoming a part of a history where the new uh, innovation in a transportation sector is being introduced to the world. I am lucky to be a part of uh, this journey and we will make it uh, happen on the ground so that uh, our coming generation to see because as you know uh, railways has taken 100 years to come to that level of uh, transportation what you see today and likewise uh, uh, metro also has taken almost 100 years because the tubes were in UK has been made 100 years back. So likewise, this is a <coughs> ongoing process and it is a journey and I'm happy to be part of it and uh, we will try our level best to make it happen on the ground. Thank you very much, Mr. Raman. I wish you success in this journey. I hope it will not be too long.